baby, I'm cold, y'all. Hi. Hi, two people. How are y'all? Oh, wait. Let me see. Hey, Jess. How you doing? How you doing? Hey, people. She been working. <laughs> Hey, Chosen. I mean, sorry, not Chosen. Oh, hey, you madness. <laughs> How you been? Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Thank you. I appreciate Dakota. Welcome to the family. Welcome to the family. Thank you, Empress. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate y'all. Before we get started... We gonna sage off, okay? We gonna purge. We gonna purge this mother sucker. Okay? Okay. Cause we ain't finna play. I been good. I can't complain. Today's been a great day. Okay. We'll take a swig of water, y'all, and then we're gonna be up in here. Oh, I already took it out. <laughs> you like a cat doing it? <laughs> what is it playing with that little bell thing on the string? <laughs> All right. Who ya? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I keep hearing the word abandoned, abandoned. Something was abandoned. Something was abandoned and left. I'm getting somebody who got authority. Something was abandoned and left to somebody who's in, um, who's in authority. I heard public, so it's a public figure who was in authority here. Something was left and abandoned, so somebody came and took over. And somebody started an empire with it. Yeah, this person built this up from the ground. Somebody definitely built something up from the ground. I'm getting a firm foundation. Somebody who's definitely in the authority. I don't know why every time I see authority, I think of a Leo. But I heard that. Yeah, I got the pop, the um, the pop, <laughs> the top of the deck. I got a authority. Why well, keep? I almost said authority. Somebody definitely is in authority. Something was abandoned, and somebody's now in authority. Somebody now has leeway. Somebody now is in control of some type of um accomplishment, some type of um business. Yeah, somebody who was in the um in poverty now they're not in poverty. Yeah, somebody got some type of business. Something was left. And somebody came and swooped in and built it from the ground here. It's giving empire energy. You know that, that show Empire? When um Lucius built something from the ground up, that's what it's giving. It's giving that. Like somebody worked very, 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 very hard. Money could be very significant. Somebody definitely got a loaded amount of money right now. I don't know why I feel like I'm talking about somebody's story here. I'm telling somebody's story. Somebody's going to write a, a, a documentary about how they built something up. Somebody definitely finna write a documentary or something. That could be significant. Yeah, I got authority here. This could be y'all's person. This is y'all person I'm talking about. This is y'all person. This motherfucker in y'all energy. Yeah, the lovers here.
I don't know why I'm getting somebody, um, because I'm trying to figure out why am I getting, like, why am I hearing this? Something is for there. Something is, them, is for them to own and keep. I'm seeing them having copyright to something, a certain amount of music or copyrights to a brand, to a brand name. Fuck the, what, I won't say F the brand, but like the brand name. Yeah, I'm seeing home here. Homeland, homeline. This is their home. It's something about that. Somebody having copyright or somebody having rights to a claim. I don't know what the fuck. I'm just, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I really don't. I really don't. But somebody definitely got somebody got land. I heard land. Somebody got land that is supposed to be in a right here. I got the journey. Somebody definitely closed out some type of case. Closed out some type of journey here. A case could have been closed for real, for real. Something keep poking me. I'm sorry, y'all. But something was poking me in my shirt. I think it's one of them plastic things that you be ripping off. Because I'll be keeping them in my shirts. Okay, so we got the journey here. Somebody completed out a cycle here. Somebody let something go. Something's no longer being held on to. The thoughts it was in the reverse, though. We don't get that let go. We don't even get that at it. Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. giving somebody left a business to um a masculine and they didn't know that something was gonna work out like somebody could have literally gave divine masculine a piece um a piece of land or a building and they didn't think he was gonna do anything with it but but it turns out he built something from the ground up somebody thought he wasn't gonna make it yeah this man turned around and built his own family legacy and he's still building from the ground up. That's what it's giving. Somebody abandoned something and left it to a man. He worked his way up, put himself on the map, and that's what that was. Somebody's mad about that. Somebody's, yeah. Somebody try to do some type of magic here, put divine masculine in danger. I don't know, I'm getting car crash could be significant. Beverly Hills. That damn hill, that cliff. Wait, let me look. How much? 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 What is that word? How much? No, not how much. How much? How much? How much? How much? Homage. Homage, homage. Special honor. Yeah. Respect shown publicly. They pay homage to the great poet. Yeah. I'm cold. It's so freaking cold in here, y'all. Like, I can really freeze my breast off. Like, I feel like I'm living in, um, I'm living in the uh, Polar Express or something. <laughs> that ain't the thing. <laughs> I just be talking about. I'm really cold. Um, where I was at? Okay, yeah. Okay, so we got here the coffin. We got here the coffin. But I'm. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not get. I'm, what I'm getting from this is that yeah, somebody tried to get rid of divine masculine because he's now like it's like he made a name for himself. Like, this man made a name for himself. Like, when I was naming off what was going on and somebody's creating a biography, somebody literally could be wanting to create a biography. Or Divine Master may want to create a biography, a whole movie, a movie, a movie, a movie about what the fuck going on right now. Like, with his life and how he, like, how far he had to come to get to where he needed to get. But I'm also getting from this coffin card, I'm getting that somebody who passed away, like an ancestor or somebody from a long time ago, left Divine Masculine 
a piece of land, a place where he can grow and give to his kids. And he can expand and build on that he can make wealth with. That's what I'm getting. That's exactly what I'm getting. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. I'm getting Divine Masculine paid. Pay, I, I'm hearing my head. He paved the way for himself. He paved his own damn pathway. This man worked. This man worked. He started off with nothing. He started off with nothing. And then he built his way up. He built his way up. I got here a message. It's something about receiving a message here. I don't know why I'm hearing. I heard ordained. Somebody could be getting ordained. or A divine masculine or a divine femme could be getting ordained. I don't know why I'm seeing somebody receiving some type of honor here. When I, I heard the, the, the word homage, homage, um, then I heard homeland. So it's something in that sense. And I looked it up because I didn't really know what homage meant. I really didn't and didn't. Um, homage was really about, uh, yeah, the my masculine is heavily thinking about a woman here. He's thinking about how he can, how life is going to be. I'm seeing somebody thinking about what, how much he can do with some type of land here. Divine Masculine could have came into some type of land or he's going to come into some type of land that he found out that was left from his ancestors to him. I don't know why I heard something about somebody getting into um, trouble here. Somebody definitely could have took over that land and that's that they like um, is fearful of Divine Masculine coming to take it because where are they going to go? Where are they going to sleep? But they got to get off their land if it's not theirs. Um... Yeah. I'm saying somebody paying respects. If they're not paying respects to Divine Masculine, they're paying respects to something that he built. But I'm still seeing it's Divine Masculine, so it's what he built. Something about somebody paying respects to what this man built, to what he called home. Somebody's going home to pay their respects. Somebody could be um, visiting um, a grave site coming up soon. That could also be a thing. Yeah. The Mount Masculine is definitely coming in with a um, proposal. If it's not a marriage proposal, <laughs> if it's not a marriage proposal, proposal the fuck I want to say, I don't know. But um, now I'm hearing that song, that girl is poison, poison. Like, um, Divine Masculine definitely thinks, Divine Femme, they think you are um, poisonous. But at the same time, they still want to come in towards you. Because it's something here, but I'm hearing that song, that girl is poison. She's poison. But I'm not getting that in a bad way, though. You could be a little deadly. I heard a silent killer. Silent killer. Then I just heard, don't touch my prize possession. Um... Anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, it's a proposal coming in towards you. Really soon. Really soon. Yeah, somebody's gonna give you an offer. Somebody's gonna wanna um keep you right beside it. Um keep keep you right beside this um themselves. So I can't even talk. Keep them right beside you. Keep them right beside you. Keep them right. They wanna keep you right beside them. So they're gonna offer you a job here. Somebody's going to offer you a place in that position. Yeah. Because you're a great fortune. Unexpected income. 
great fortune. Then I got a child here. Um, when I got from that, I got legacy. Somebody definitely wants to give you a place in their community, in their business for a legacy. Somebody sees a legacy with you. It's like all this person is thinking about is, is how y'all both can build. How long lasting can a business be? Fuck, how can I say that? Like how long lasting a business can stand for the legacy of the children? Because when I see children, I'm saying legacy. I'm saying greatness. I'm saying success. I'm seeing a lot of power being in the hands of, for some of y'all, y'all could have a three-year-old, but I'm just, it's just an example, like a whole lot of power. Like when you leave here, you're going to have a whole lot of, you're going to have a whole lot of money. You're going to have a whole lot of um, businesses. You're going to have a whole lot of legacy to fulfill here. That's what I'm getting. That's solely what I'm getting. Yeah. Expectation. The mom asking definitely want kids. Y'all already knew that. I feel like this is stuff I'm already telling y'all. Y'all already knew. But, um, I got, yeah, expectation. Yeah, because you're going to want to be, yeah, you're going to want kids. You're going to be expecting kids. Especially to leave behind your legacy. Then I got main male here. You got to mail your energy. You got to mail in your energy. Who is working with a community of people? This I'm here. Res, yeah, residency. This person is working with people in the community to have you have a message of concern. Um, I heard in my head, I don't trust that boy. So these people don't trust this person. This could be family. This could very well be family here. They don't trust. Yeah. I'm seeing this person's working with either your family or Devon Maskin's family. It's like they're working with people in the community. And they want you to have a message of concern about somebody in your family. Or it's like they, I'm getting like more so like a warning or letting you know out front that you got somebody in your family that you cannot trust. You got somebody in your family that you cannot trust. And these people don't even trust divine, um, divine masculine. These people don't even trust this man here. Somebody's last name could be Boyd. B-O-Y-D. Boyd. Yeah. Somebody's last name could be Boyd. Somebody could drink Budweiser's. But, yeah. You got somebody in your family that steals. That's been stealing from you. That's been trying to replace you for years now. Yeah, this person is karmic. I'm, I got stalemate. This person has been trying to keep you from your money, keep you from your relationship, keep you from your path here. This person definitely has some type of drastic changes to their, um, to their appearance. You cannot have seen this person in a while now. Courthouse here. I'm seeing... Uh, uh, Dang. Okay, I'm seeing papers here. Papers coming from the court, probably about this person. Somebody definitely got a record for petty larceny or something. Somebody got a criminal background. Yep. Papers. Okay, so y'all can have a cousin. I got I heard a cousin specifically that is living in a house that is yours. You got a cousin that is living in a house that is yours. Yep. And it's funny. You got a cousin living in the house that is yours. I got here is a woman and a man here. Who's I heard who's second guessing their place inside of a coven here. Yeah, somebody's willing to somebody's trying to run off here. 
Somebody's trying to run. I'm hearing somebody's time is, has expired. I don't hear it. Time is up. Yeah, they're trying their best to figure out how to escape some type of karma here. Somebody had a realization. They're trying to escape. Main female as well. Oh, yeah. I like this. I like this energy. Yeah. Somebody's definitely found out about. Somebody's got um, caught up here. Somebody didn't think they were going to get. Yeah. They've, somebody thought they won't get caught up. Somebody thought they had more time. Definitely people in your family. It's a man in your family. It's a woman in your family. And it's a young girl in your family. Older woman, older man, a young female who thought they had more time to hide something, to place something out of your reach so they so, to, so that you can't get in touch with it. Yeah, I'm hearing time is up. Time is up. It's time for them to hand over. Somebody don't want to relieve or something. Yeah, somebody also could be going to jail. Somebody could be suffering from jail time. Divine Femme. I don't know why I feel like it's going to be your choice if somebody's could, um, if somebody's, if you maybe want to press charges against somebody due to something that happened in the past. Because I'm getting whatever, like, involved in that, whatever going on with this house here. This is giving a felony charge. This is a charge alone. Somebody's stealing something. Somebody definitely wrote something in your name that you did not, um, you, did, you did not consent to. You did not consent to something not um, being in your name. You definitely did not consent to these people writing your name on a paper. This is fraud. This is felony alone. This is felony alone. You got four people. I'm looking at four people here that literally could be... No, I'm sorry. Three people. I'm not even going to include you in that. I'm sorry. I'm looking at about three people here who could be doing jail time. Like I said, be doing jail time. And it's going to be up to you. It's going to be up to you. And you'll be surprised on who all these people is. I'm literally look, I'm looking at divine ma um not divine, I keep saying divine masculine. I'm looking at um divine masculine. This could be you. This could really be your people. You got a older family member, you got an older um older woman or man and a um sister or a cousin, a sibling. Sibling could be significant. Who literally will be facing jail time. Yeah. Somebody definitely trying to escape here. Somebody trying to escape. Mm-hmm. Somebody's trying to run. Somebody trying to escape. I don't know why I'm saying somebody throw something in the river. Somebody definitely could have threw something and ran. Somebody definitely not trying to face this. Something's working in your favor. Yep, despair. They don't want to face this. They don't want to face it. I'm hearing when this happens, a lot of shit is over with. A lot of people was playing games. Now they don't want to play. All of a sudden, now they want to come and give you a gift. All of a sudden, now they want to be nice to you. Yeah, because shit is changing. Something is working in your favor. People are going down. I heard I don't care. Yeah. People are going to jail. This is a charge. This is a charge. I heard I don't care. Somebody said they don't care about going to jail. They don't care. Somebody reached a certain level to where they don't care what happens. Yeah, change is coming. Somebody tried to have you stuck. Depending on them. This definitely could be on um, Divine Masculine. This is specifically for Divine Masculine. A man who thought his family was pure. A man who thought he was doing the best thing for their family the whole time. They were doing shit behind the scenes. Keeping shit hidden. Keeping stuff away from you. Divine Masculine has felt this out. Divine Masculine is taking these people to court. Divine Masculine is taking a man to court. An older woman to court. And a girl to court. All because of some shit that was done to Divine Film, Because this has something to do with you as well. Now they in despair. Now they want some type of 
pick me up. Now they want this man to feel bad about them because they ain't feel bad when they were doing this to Divine Masculine on Divine Film. To Divine Film on Divine Masculine. And when I said Divine Masculine is taking hoes to court, Divine Masculine said, nah, y'all gotta pay. This is a felony charge. This is fraud. This is fraud. This is fraud. He's taking his motherfuckers to court. And everybody else on your family, divine film, that has something to do with it or did something to you, they will be dealt with as well. They may not be going to court, but they're going to get that karma done. Somebody definitely could be going to jail though. Seeing somebody getting out on bail. Yeah, they're concerned. They're concerned. Somebody in your family could sell marijuana. They could get pulled over for soliciting or having a whole lot on more, a whole lot of pounds of weed. They could go to jail for that. Somebody got anger issues, beat on people, domestic violence. Somebody going to jail for that. These people are, they're out of here. Bangladesh. What is that? Confirmation with the one on 11 views. Hey, MF. Like, they really tried it here. I'm hearing shit escalating. It's escalating very quickly, very quickly, very quickly. Yeah. Devon Maxim is coming into his boo. Like I told y'all, when it's all over, I gotta be next to you. Yeah. <laughs> when it's all over, I gotta be next to you. Salam. Devon Maxim got a gift for y'all. Devon Maxim got a gift. I'm not going to lie. Okay, so if family members have been acting weird or if family members have been calling you, if family members have been calling you to check up on you, to see what you got going on, they won't know if you're mad. They won't know what you got going on. For some of y'all, they won't know what you got going on. I'm, I, <laughs> I heard in my head the devil. They want to know. They want to know so they can get ahead of it. When they calling, they want to know if they you know, they want to see if they can get ahead. When they checking up, they want to see if they can get ahead. Yeah, Devon Maxson got a gift. He's coming in with a gift here. That's a producer music tag. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mature man down. Why the fuck? Mature, that one ain't supposed to be back in the deck. You see how this motherfucker just slipped into the deck? It's a mature man here who's going to try to get away. He's going to try to run away. I feel like this man is for all for himself. All for himself. He's trying to run away for something. He did something here. Because why did this, this came back in the deck and I didn't mean to? Somebody trying to take themselves off the equation. They trying to take themselves off the map. Because why does this not supposed to be? This, this, this was already out here. This man is down. Stay away right there. Thank you. You ain't uh -uh, trying to run off. You ain't gonna run nowhere. You thought you was slick. They thought they won't. This person thought he won't get caught. Stuck in poverty. There you go. Stuck in poverty and concerned. Child guy, I had a fuck that. That's crazy. This motherfucker sneaky. This is a sneaky old man here. This motherfucker moves fast with them um achy knees he got. I don't know why I heard competitive here. This man was competitive. He was relying on divine masculine with his extra streams of income here. I don't know why I'm getting a, per, um, a music producer. It's getting very much creepy. Somebody can have goals in their mouth. I don't know why I'm getting an older man who's trying to act like he's young. Try to fit in with the young kids. Try to fit in with the crowd. To feel important. But on, or to not look suspect in anything. To not look suspect. Somebody trying to play their cards right. Hopefully you won't let them go to jail. Somebody definitely could be sad. They don't want to go to jail.
And this could be happening. This is happening right now. This going down right now. The mom masculine took over the whole motherfucking reading. I like this. I like this. I like this. Okay. Ooh. I like to have Aries placements. I got the Queen of Cups here. I'm here now, abandoned again. I got the own um, somebody who has Aries placements. I could be talking about a woman here. I got abandoned. Somebody has abandonment issues. Somebody's afraid of being led on. Or somebody's going to be led on here. Somebody's playing a dangerous game. Confirmation. Divine Masculine, you got a woman in your energy here. I don't know why, again, somebody could be from the South. I heard Hillbilly. Somebody definitely could be from Texas. Somebody could be from VA. Somebody down from South. Down from South. South. <laughs> somebody definitely could be soft-spoken. They could have a soft voice. Be careful. Yeah. Um, Page of um, Swords in the Reverse. I'm getting this is somebody who literally... Is not coming in to speak or they don't speak. They, like, they don't say something. Somebody's not saying something. Yeah, somebody wants to come in with an offer. Page of Cups in the reverse. Oh, sorry, I said Page of Cups. I didn't mean to say Page of Cups. Page of Cups in the reverse is all about manipulation. Somebody who's not emotionally secure within themselves. Somebody who don't know how to speak. They don't know how to talk. They don't know how to express how they feel. Yeah, them giving somebody with abandonment issues. Somebody could have in a third party um position, divine masculines. Could be a castle Pisces or Scorpio here with this one water sign. A woman who's scared of commitment, scared of being abandoned as well. So it's like, I don't know. It's like she's scared of commitment, but she's scared of somebody leaving her alone here. I'm getting concerned. This woman is concerned about you. You could definitely not be in communication with her at all. Like she don't really. Like y'all not in communication. She ain't communi she ain't in communication with you, and you not in communication with her. She wanna come in with an offer here. She could have gave you the bare minimum. She definitely could have gave you the bare minimum. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I'm saying she thought she thinks of you as a blessing. Somebody got a crush on you. Somebody definitely got a crush on you, divine masculine. Somebody definitely look. I'm hearing that song. Um, I smile. He walked by and I smile back. It's a song by Lotto called Crush. Somebody got a crush on you. Somebody been looking at you for a while now. Somebody wants to know how things are between y'all, but they scared to come towards you because they don't know how to speak to a person like you. They scared. Of, they have commitment. They scared of commitment here. They have issues with commitment. Somebody sees you as successful. Somebody feels like when they saw you, it was fate. And they and they feel like they deserve to be with you or they're destined to be with you. Somebody definitely want to bring in another string of income towards you. Somebody wants to maybe invest in you, Divine Masculines. But with the Page of Souls in the reverse, it's giving they own, like, it's no communication, no contact. I heard spiritual. It's something here about this person could be spiritual or spiritualist. But I'm not going to lie. It's like this person want to come in. They want to come in and say something. Yeah. To move this. Like I'm hearing to move this along. To move things along. Yeah. But like I said, they still could be stuck on their ex. They still got an ex they're attached to. Somebody wants to come in towards you they want to move things along with you but they still got an exit they stuck on they still got an exit they stuck on 
but they uh, I'm hearing they not in a non um it's it's a, like a non commitment type of thing, but they she's still stuck on this person. She want to move towards you, but she's still stuck in some type of karmic lesson, some type of karmic cycle here. I almost said cycle. Like what the fuck? <laughs> but um child. This shit is crazy. She's still stuck on a man here, but I'm not getting I'm not getting she's evil. It's just, yeah, this woman definitely wants, she she got some feelings for you. She'll definitely pick up and leave with, for you. But it's like she's stuck. She literally could be stuck. She could be still closing out a cycle with this man. Yeah, she won't change. She wants things to change. She don't want to be with this man no more. She don't, but she's stuck. Something is keeping her stuck. She definitely got love here. What would you do if you were in that situation? Uh, I ain't gonna lie. I try to get away first. The only thing I can do is get away, get my situation right, get my mental right. Then I'll worry about getting with somebody else. Until then, it's no hope. You know, I'm just burying a bigger hole for myself. That's what I do. I just worry about getting myself out of there. Yeah. Somebody want to come in with some type of offer here. They want to come in with something new. You might want to come in towards you with something new here. Somebody been checking you out for a minute. Somebody may want to come in with a uh, op or offer or opportunity for you. They want to come in with some little some some. Somebody wants to build with you. Yeah. Somebody definitely wants to build with you. Somebody could be a Sagittarius. Yeah. It's like this person is trying to find healing. Yeah, they're trying to find healing. This person wants something new. They want new love. They want new. This person is trying to heal so they can come in. And I feel like they are being put in a position to heal. They are being put in a position to heal. They are healing. Somebody definitely is going through healing. Collective, you could have made this person want to heal. They're all just waiting for their opportunity. Somebody's waiting for the right time to come in. They're waiting for the say-so to move. Yeah. Because somebody's still... I'm getting still operating in that... Um, in the, like, the page energy. Somebody's still in their page energy. They don't know what to do. Somebody don't have many opportunities. They don't have many ideas or many opportunities like you know to choose from. They're just waiting for a specific opportunity to come in. With the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Swords. I mean, I said the Ace of Swords. That's the truth, though. I said Ace of Swords. They waiting for clarity. They waiting for the truth. They waiting for something to come in. But with the Ace of Wands, they waiting for opportunities so they can get away here. Because somebody definitely wants to get away. They've been thinking about this for a while. Because they stuck. They know they're stuck. They've been wanting something new. They want something. They've been inspired by somebody or something to move on. But they're stuck. This woman could be a Pisces, for real. This could be a Pisces woman. This woman could be a um cancer as well. This could be a cancer. Yeah, somebody's that it's, it's some type of action coming towards um this woman. Leo could be significant. Just going to put her in the energy to where she'll be confident to move. It's something here about some type of... But I'm seeing conflict, though. I'm seeing conflict. I'm seeing conflict. It's like something like... Some type of action is coming in. Some type of action is coming in. It's going to put somebody in a position to be able to have the strength and the power to leave. But I'm also seeing conflict in her leaving it's going to be conflict when she leaves she knows it's going to be conflict when she comes when she tries to leave because she's planning to move it's definitely something coming in it's going to help her move but it's going to be conflict it's going to be a fight somebody's definitely heavily obsessive and competitive over this woman i'm getting leo energy um cancer energy sagittarius energy capricorn energy Pisces energy. 
It's some type of fight. It's going to be a struggle for this woman to leave. I don't know why I heard she should have left when she had the chance, but she decided to take another chance on this man. Because she had an opportunity. The door was open, but she didn't take it because she, she was still stuck. She wanted to give him another chance, which is fine because things happen for a reason. She had to really, really, really fully see that things wasn't going to change, and now you had to take yourself out. Yeah, something, yeah. She wasn't trying to cause judgment. It's like now she decided to cause judgment. Now she decided to make things shake. Now she's deciding to change. I feel like she's awakening too. She's going through some type of awakening. She's now starting to see what she needs to see here. But I guess things happen for a reason. I'm, I'm standing on things happen for a reason. When you ain't ready, you're not ready. And you know when you're ready. So I can never blame nobody for that. So... I feel like at this like at this point she's definitely gonna leave. This man could definitely try to put his hands on her for real. Definitely try to put his hands on her. Cause it's like, look, she can't speak to you. It's giving abusive. She can't speak. She can't really talk. She can't come near you. I feel like she only did that because she was trying to spare you. This man definitely could be dangerous. I'm sorry, I got hair on my own blanket. This man definitely could be dangerous here. I don't like this energy. Like, I don't like it. Yeah, she's planning some. Like, that's the truth, bro. She got, she know the truth now. She got clarity. She's now starting to see her way out the tunnel. She's seeing her way out the tunnel. She's been awoken to something. I'm seeing the hermit card. She could be a, somebody could be a Virgo. She had Virgo placements. It's like she's seeing her way out here. She found the sunshine. She found her light. Now she's just trying to get out now. She sees the truth. She knows the truth. She sees this man's truth. She sees this man worth and he won't worth shit. She won't worth it. I'm sorry. She won't worth. <laughs> he won't worth ish. She now sees the truth. Everything that she's been avoiding has been put in her face so many times. Literally. And she's now, like, she got her guard up. She's now moving. She's trying to move. She's trying to find her way out here. She's trying. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, she can definitely live with this man. They could be engaged just a little bit. It's something here about family. She live in house with family. Hi, people. Hi. How y'all doing? I hope y'all having a good Thursday. Wait, no, it's actually it's Friday. Happy Friday. Like, it's something about them building. Yeah, it's money invested in this. They got some type of family going on here. It's money invested in this. It's more than what it seems. She could have been with this man on years, on years, on years. She could have been with this man on years. I'm hearing things that have, things has gotten out of hand, gotten complicated. It's too much. I'm getting a lot of stress here. A lot of um therapy needed. This woman definitely need to come to some healing because she's been through a lot. A lot. Like, she put herself in this position here. She's in some type of prison. It's like, it's a lot at stake, but she got to get out, though. She can't stay. If she stays, she'll be D-I-E. She'll be D-I-E. She'll be D-E-A-D. She can't stay. She, like, she she can't. She could be definitely going through depression. It's like, it's like a lot of um depression. Yeah, she got two decisions to make. And whatever decision she's going to make is going to definitely help with this juggling situation here. Yeah, because she got abundance. She got money here. Oh, she came to some type of money. She got some money on her. Um, she got some money that came in. She definitely could be trying to figure out her next move here with the two on two. She's trying to figure out her next move. She's trying to figure out, figure out her next move here. She's trying to think, it, like, is it is it us or is it my family? She's trying to think, is it, like, is it do I save me or do I, do I stay with my family? Because she's not happy. This woman is not happy. She just want to move on. She want to get away. She's not happy. 
She's not happy. Yeah. Okay, so. Um, for some of y'all, if this woman asks you for, um, if this woman asks you for your help, I think you should definitely give her help because then I just heard S-O-S, please. Someone help me. It's not healthy. Like I'm hearing that song S-O-S by, um, and I'm hearing why, oh, you are making this hard. You got me tossing and turn. Please, fun, please, someone come and rescue me. And no, 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 I'm still I'm losing it. Yeah, that's what I heard exactly after I heard me help because i feel like some of y'all are going to definitely have to help this woman yeah she may need some help if she asks you for some help or she just talked to you out the blue or i ain't, i ain't gonna lie i'm not seeing her asking it's gonna be more so like a cry like you know you know what a cry for help looks like you know what i'm saying you're gonna know if somebody's gonna need some type of help like it's gonna be like a cry like a cry situation. Like I'm looking at this fight card. Like you're going to, like it's going to be some type of fight that's going to take place. Some type of fight. Some type of fight. She's going to act, she's going to be crying off for help. Now I'm here crying out for me. Now I'm here crying out for me. And then he like the part where he was like, um, come in, come in, come in, save me, save me. Like that part, I'm hearing that part. So it's it's gonna be a time where you're gonna have to help this woman. Like, um, it's gonna be some, she's gonna need some help. Cause it's gonna be a big old fight. She ain't gonna she she ain't gonna be able to get all this by herself. I mean, I'm saying like. I, I just, I, I don't know. I'm seeing tables turning, twist, like shit twisting up. Shit twisting up. Somebody getting folded up like a pretzel. And not in a good way. All right. Um, um, the show, Beverly, um, what's that movie, The Beverly Hills of Chihuahua? That movie could be very significant. I don't know why I thought of the Beverly, uh, I don't know why I thought, um, The Beverly Hills of Chihuahua. Ain't that what that movie called? The Beverly Hills of Chihuahua? I don't know why that movie is significant. Somebody could own a Chihuahua. I don't know what that movie is called. The Beverly Hills of Chihuahua. I don't even know what that was it called, but I really don't know. But anyways, um, it's a man here who got some type of business or some type of authority about himself, right? I got the page of cups. This man is definitely learning to love here. He's learning to be more creative. He's learning to fend for himself, you know, pour into his cup. This man is learning something new. Maybe um, this man is coming to his intuition. It's like he's growing here. He's learning. This man is in his learning phase, his learning stage. Yeah. This man see you, sees you as success here, successful. He sees you as accomplished. This person also sees you as independent. I'm seeing hyperly independent. Um, I'm also getting this person could be um feeling very hypersexual when it comes towards you. Like this person definitely could feel a little dangerous. Like I feel like around you, this person could feel dangerous, very lethal because it's like some sort of type of attraction he has towards you. Somebody could have a serpent tattoo, a snake tattoo could be significant. This person is definitely could be in the public eye. This person sees you as successful. They feel like you belong in the public eye. They definitely want to bring you out into the open. Because there's something here about you. See how you green veil around her? She's protected. Like, she's by herself. She's alone in her own little place in the field. Like, la 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 Like, you know, you're just doing, you dancing, minding your business in the field of flowers, just in your own bubble, in your own lane. And somebody's wanting to bring you out of that. Somebody wants to bring you out of your comfort zone. They want to bring you out so they can build you. Somebody wants to build you. They want to build your brand. You got a certain brand about you. They want to bring that out of you. Somebody feels like the whole world deserves to see you. Somebody sees you has talent and they want to bring it out. 
Bring it out, bring it out. Dun, dun, dun. Bring it out, bring them out. Yeah. It's a tower going on here. It's a tower going on. No I'm kidding. Oh, God. All right. Um, You almost had me, buddy. I like the tower here. Something is not built on. Um, something's going to fall here. Collect, you're going to make something fall. Something's going to fall. Somebody's going to try to bring some type of deception towards you. And you're going to see right through it. Somebody got some type of hidden motive when it comes toward when it comes to you. Somebody's in this use. Somebody's in this using energy. Yeah, somebody's doing some type of magic here. Some type of spell or magic here to keep themselves up or re and relevant. Somebody could be doing some type of um love spell or something to get you to like them. This person definitely could be um, a social butterfly. This person definitely could be known here. Well known. Yeah, I got creative. I got creative. This person knows what they want. They knows what they doing. They know what the fuck going on. They know. I heard building. This person definitely tried to build something. They want to build with you. But I'm getting built. They want to build off of you. Somebody definitely may want to be your manager. This is giving somebody who want to be your manager. Somebody who's definitely head over in the um, in the clouds here. Whose head is in the clouds. I'm hearing that song. It's me and you. It's me and you. Somebody definitely got a little thing for you. Yep. I'm hearing that song by Trina and Keisha Cole. I got a thing for you, baby. You know. Yep, somebody's definitely coming in to be manipulative. Somebody definitely is um is good with their words. Very good with their words. They're coming in very manipulative. Ugh. Somebody feels like you and them will make magic. Yeah. Yep. Somebody wants you to walk away. It's something here about you walking away from some type of collaboration. Somebody definitely wants you to come towards them. They want to get you. Yeah, it's something here about you being in your head. Somebody's going to definitely try to manipulate you to make it seem like you are the problem and you're doing things and this wouldn't have happened if I wouldn't have met you or why are you doing this? Somebody's going to want to control you. Yeah, somebody's going to threaten you and be like, I'll keep you hidden. I'll stop this. I'll stop that from happen to, happening for you. Yeah, somebody's going to promise you success here. Somebody's going to want to partner up with you, work with you. They're going to promise you success. And it's going to be like, they're going to be like, oh, this is going to be the best thing for you. This is going to be the best thing for you. Okay. You could sit on this for a while. You could sit on this for a while. I don't know why I'm getting this person could think you're thirsty for fame. You're thirsty for success. Because they feel like everybody want to be famous. Yeah, everybody want to be famous. They feel like they're taking you out of some type of poverty situation. Because of something that you're building. I don't know why I'm getting like your face. They don't care about what your talent is. They care about your face. They don't care what your talent is. They, all they care about is your face. That's all they care about. Your face can get you places. They don't care. Yeah. Somebody wants you solely dependent on them. Yeah, this could be a um, king of swords. This could be a Gemini man or a Pisces. The truth is going to come out. This person thinks you're not going to see right through them. This person literally is trying to come and have you in this energy. They look. I don't know why I'm getting this man don't respect women. This man, this man thinks that women deserve to be put on a leash. 
and walked like dogs. This man don't respect women. This man do not like women in power. They think women shouldn't be in power. They think women don't deserve to be in power. And if you disrespect them, they'd be like, who are you? And you will see that. You will definitely see the truth. It's like the way they, this person is going to speak to you. It's going to be insane. This person is going to manipulate your mom, manipulate things that you say, lie on you, lie to you. This person is going to make you do what they want you to do. They think all women deserve to, you know, um, suck and F their way through life. This man do not respect women. They do not even like women. It's giving this person don't respect women. And you're going to see that? You're going to know the truth here? This person only signs you because of your body and how you can work your body to get to where you need to be so they can get up and top. This person wants to get up and top to get to a certain level here off of you. I don't know why I'm thinking about, uh, what's the girl name? I'm thinking about Marilyn Monroe. People thought this woman was just a face and a pretty face and a nice body. They ain't know she was a real person inside. They used this woman because of her body. She got places because she was beautiful. They ain't really want to work with her. All they want to do was see her naked. And they wanted her to, they're like, they're like, smile, let me see your pretty face. This is what it's giving. Let me see your pretty face. Smile, let me see your pretty face. They didn't care about what she had to say. They didn't care about what she wanted to do. They just wanted her face. They didn't want. They, they just wanted her face on magazine. They just wanted to run her. It's giving men a man. I'm sorry, men. It could be men behind this man who's he working together with to get this to happen. But it's giving this man definitely could just want to use you because of your face, your platform. Everybody wants to be successful. Everybody wants to be famous. Yeah, they see you working. That shit don't matter. They don't care. They don't care. They don't care about what you're working for. They just care about how much money you can get them. They don't care. They just care about how much money you can give them. Texas Pete could be significant. I only know what that is. Texas Pete, Texas Roadhouse could be very significant. Okay, I got something um, about Herman mode here. Something here about you being in Herman mode or a Virgo could be significant. It's something about you being in Hermit mode. You knowing your value is very significant here. It's because somebody's gonna try to come in and play with that. Or somebody knows you knows your you know your value based off how you are and how you portray yourself. Yeah, somebody's been watching. Like I said, somebody knows who you are. They know what you um. They know what you're about. They know what you won't do. Somebody's hoping that you will let something slide here. It's something here about your religion, what you praise, who you worship. It's something here about that. Somebody may want to um come in with some type of heartbreak here, some type of lesson. Somebody knows. Somebody's been trying to study and watch you and trying to see who you praise, who you worship, hoping that you'll let something slide between you two. I'm hearing it just between us. Let's keep something between us here. Yeah, it could be a water sign male here. A water sign male is very significant. Somebody may want to come in with some type of offer here. This could be a man who definitely could be emotionally manipulative. Somebody who could be a narcissist. This person is definitely heartbroken. They got the they, they got a lot of trauma here. This person trauma bonds. This person definitely wants you to do whatever they say so. Divine masculine. This could be for you as well. This could definitely be um happy birthday, Michelle. Um, this could definitely be for you as well. Yeah, somebody's coming in with some type of competition or fight here. I don't know why it's giving a man who like to see women struggle or put them in a position to where they can struggle. Then he'll come in and swoop them and help them. 
This is giving that type of situation. Divine masculine, put it in your shoes. You could be a type of person like to help people. This woman could be a type of woman that will put herself in a dangerous position, cause situations to happen, so that way you'll come in and help her. This is a dangerous individual. This person literally put themselves in predicaments to that way you'll help them. It's giving weird though. I don't know why it's giving like fatal attraction. It's giving them fatal attraction shows, the um them shows where you be with somebody and they be strangely attached to you or strangely got some type of oh uh, sick fantasy or sick obsession with um having you go out your way to do something for them or help them and then them getting off on you helping them or them getting off on seeing you struggle. This is this is giving that. Somebody will literally bash into your car and then to see you bleeding out and struggling. And then they'll wait. Yeah, like that. It's giving that. It's, it's, it's like somebody always got a hidden motive here. Somebody's definitely sneaky. Very sneaky. Somebody's watching you. Somebody knows you stay in isolation. Somebody knows you stay hidden. But not for no reason. They know you stay hidden for a reason. Somebody knows you're grounded. Somebody knows you're balanced here. Somebody's all about the win. Somebody's all about allowing people to struggle and compete and fight for them. They love to see women beat themselves the fuck up. This person literally be a sassy. They could love watching baddies. They could love seeing women whoop they like this type, bro. This type of person that will literally let two women fight over each other to the to blood shed. And then he'll break it up at the end. Like, bro, just giving somebody who don't care. They just like to see. They reckless. They love to see like that shit like that. It's giving that energy. Like, I don't like this. It's 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 weird. Yeah. I'm seeing the truth will come out. The truth, somebody could be a Leo. Somebody could be a Leo. This person could be childish, immature. Somebody preys on the fact that you're um you're a little childish, you're a little immature here. Somebody could prey on the fact that you smile or you're a good person. They want to know how far you will go and how far you will take it. Yeah. It's something here about your childlike spirit. It's something here about your purity. You being a good person, you being a good girl. I'm hearing somebody be like, oh, that's a good girl. You're a good girl. Somebody preys on that. Like, it's, it's, it's weird. It's weird. It's weird. It's weird. I don't like that. Somebody's preying on your purity here. This is giving devil energy here. Somebody, this type of person that would like to suck you till you got nothing. Suck you until you're dry, till you have nothing. Somebody wants to take your, your childhood. They want to take your, your purity. Somebody wants to suck the child like out of you. This is what it's giving because this is all about you being in your childlike energy. You This is you being a page, like an amateur, a fool, somebody who's new, pure. This is also giving child, I'm getting childlike energy. Somebody wants to take your essence. Somebody want to take your, yes, I'm glad you said that. Somebody want to take your innocence. Somebody wants you because you're innocent. They love women. They, somebody got a specific type. Somebody loves the specific type. Somebody can look at a person and can tell that they'll do anything and go anywhere and do anything and go all over the world for somebody. And they like that. They like that. This is what I'm getting. This is just, ooh, 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 this is nasty. I don't like that. This is weird. This is giving a serial, this is giving serial killer energy. I'm thinking about criminal minds. When a man had a certain like somebody loves certain type of women who do this. They watch like they like to watch. They like to get the certain details. That's very significant. The certain details is very significant. They look at all of that. They look at all of that. They look at all of that. Somebody's gonna come in with opportunity here. I don't know why I feel like this person can want you to live in their basement. This is the type of person. This is the type of person that will want you to go nowhere. They'll want you to stay with them. They want you to stay with them. Somebody have a fetish. A weird fetish for somebody's innocence. It's giving, it's, it's weird. I, I can't put my finger on it. I can't, it's the way is the way they uh, the energy feel, it is giving serial killer. It's it's like it's giving that. 
It's giving that. Somebody's trying to stop you from being creative. Yeah. Somebody definitely, it's, it's like somebody's trying to stop you from shining here. Like your creativity, your spark, your light. Somebody wants to suck that out of you. This is all about you being creative. Somebody wants to suck the light out of you. Literally. Till you have nothing. That's the truth. They want to suck the light out of you. Somebody's going to give you two opportunities here. Somebody could have money. This person is heavily damaged here. I don't know why I'm getting. No, I'm not. I, I, I'm reading like in the energy here. Like if this, take it how it resonates. If, if this resonates for you, this is what y'all need to know. Like I, like this is what could, what could come in here. Like this could be a certain person. This could be for divine masculines as well. You could have a woman here who definitely could be the same way. She loves men. Like she like taking men's innocence here. That's what I'm getting. I'm getting two opportunities coming in. Somebody's going to try to come in and have you um in a better position here. With a better, like a better opportunity here. Somebody could see you struggling or somebody could see how you may need some type of help. And they could pray on that. They could pray on that and they give you an opportunity that's going to um, raise your vibration or raise your money or something. They're going to raise your, um help you with money here. Somebody wants to help you with money. Somebody could send you money out the blue here. Somebody's going to give you an opportunity that's going to help you do better, be, put you in a better position. Yeah, somebody's going to put you in a better position. So now I'm hearing, now you owe me. You owe me. That's what I'm hearing. Somebody's going to give you an opportunity just so you, they can say, you owe me. You owe me. That's what that's giving. Take this how I resonate. This cannot be from everybody for everybody, but I'm just letting y'all know. If somebody come in, and tell you that they like you with your your with, with, um they like you better in a skirt. It just like it's it's weird. Like it's it's, it's very weird. I don't know. It's it's weird. I can't even put my finger on it. It's just weird. Somebody's definitely lurking on you. This could be an older man. This is an older man. This is an older man. This is an older man. You see how his hair is gray? This person could have gray in their hair, gray in their beard. This is an older man. This person could drive a truck, an Escalade. They could drive a um a Tahu, a Tahu truck. I'm seeing a red truck, a red Escalade, or a red pickup truck, or a red Tahu truck. This person could definitely drive trucks, pickup trucks. That's very significant. Confirmation. This person drive a red pickup truck, a red Escalade. Tinted all window. This person don't like to be seen. This is something that don't this, this is something that this person don't like other people to know. They don't like other people to know about this. They could be married as well. They could hide like a secret, a hide a secret um seller or something. They have a secret seller or something. It's something here about this man. Could be a family man. And he could hide the fact that he liked these type of things. His wife may not do it for him. It's something about this man got a sick obsession with religion and sin. Like, I'm getting criminal minds-ish. Like, this person's going to maybe ask you what your religion is. Like, what do you worship? What do you like? How do you feel? Do you pray? It's giving that. It's giving that. Like, this person could be all about God, but he could worship him in the, in the wrongest way ever. This is all about the background here. He want to know. He, this person want to ask you deep, um, personal questions. How was you like when you were a child? Is you close to your parents? Do you have any children? It's a specific person that this confirmation. It's a specific type that he has. If you have no children, he'll go for you. If you don't have children. Well, I say, if you, yeah, if you have no children, you're like, this is, that's what I'm getting here. Like this person, like, it's like a sick fixation. That's what I'm getting. It's giving ill. And the more I go down the line, the more I'm getting. This person definitely could drive a pickup truck. They could have a lot of money here. They could work in construction. They could work somewhere where they have to wear glasses or heavy duty boots or something this person loves to be hidden here they don't go to many places this person could love going to i heard ihop this person could like ihop this person could like going to home depot a lot 
This person fix their own car. This person don't like just any, everybody around them. This is the type of person I'm getting because they're afraid of being found out about. Mm. Wucha. 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 Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Like, Wucha. Ooh, I have to woo saw because it's energy I'm getting. It's like, ooh, it's, I can't do it. I can't. Like, I don't, I don't like this. <sighs> All right. Um, hmm. Um, it's a new, um, it's a new opportunity coming in. It's a new opportunity coming in that's going to change your whole perspective. Something's coming in. Yep, a new opportunity is coming in. It's going to change the way you think about everything. Change the way you think about everything here. Yeah, it's something here about you letting go. You want to let go of something. You're gonna be speaking about uh, speaking out. <laughs> I speak about uh, out speaking out about something. Let's see what this is. The lover is out here. You're gonna spin it. Wait, how is it going? All right, it keep going this way though. It keep going this way. Um, hmm. The lover is all about um partnership. It don't even always gotta be about love. It could be about partnership. Um. Um. Uh, union um legacy building okay so it could be a gemini woman here right divine masculine this could be for you this could also be for you divine film i'm getting like it's i'm getting both i'm getting both gender neutral here um an opportunity is coming in you could be a pisces Somebody sees you as new. Somebody sees you as new bait, new people, new. Somebody sees you as an amateur. Somebody sees you as new here. Somebody sees you as a fool, exactly, but not a fool. Like, you a damn fool. They see you as a fool. New. Embarking on something new. Um, Somebody's going to come in and voice their opinion about something. Somebody wants to work with you. I don't know why I'm getting like a lawyer. Somebody who got some type of estate here. Yeah. I'm seeing something being one-sided though. Um, Somebody's going to want you to give more than them. Um, yeah, give more than what they are giving to you. Somebody's going to want to partner up with you. Somebody's going to want to work with you build with you but i'm seeing this being one-sided divine masculine it's a woman here who's gonna want to come in and be with you get entangled with you say that she love you get near you just for her to pull her energy back on you it's something that you got that she want yeah she's gonna try to work with you this could be a Libra. You could be a Libra. Yeah. Somebody's going to come in and ask, like, act like they want to spend the rest of their life with you. Somebody's going to want marriage. Somebody's going to want you to move quickly. Somebody who don't want to be alone. Somebody who's a, I heard a has been. Somebody who's worried about her image. Somebody who wants attention. This person's gonna want you to give to her, and she give you nothing. She's gonna want you to give her all, give your all, just so you can give her just just so just so you can fuck. She's gonna want you to give your all, just so she can give you nothing. She's gonna give you the bare minimum. I'm fucking. It just I'm here. One sided shit here. One sided. Something is one sided. Something is one sided. Something's not gonna be fair. Something's not going to be made fair. If it's a look, if it's an offer here, if it's an offer coming in, 
this person is not going to give you what you need. Like they're going to, they're not going to give you your cut, your respected cut. Somebody's going to try to come in and breadcrumb you. Somebody's going to make it seem like they all for you, but they're really not for you. This person could suffer from bipolar disorder as well. It's, somebody could suffer from the bipolar disorder as well. Somebody could suffer from bipolar disorder. Somebody could have schizophrenia in their family as well. Take this high resonate. This cannot be for everybody. There's a lot of people in here. So please take this high resonate. It's a woman here. This is not this this is not a collect this is not no zodiac. This is not no zodiac. This is a co general collective. What I pick up on is not for it may not be for everybody. So just take it how it resonate. I'm not doing signs, guys. This is not a sign thing. If it's signs, I'm gonna let y'all know. So I let all that negativity. It's negativity. It's negativity out here. It's, it's a lot of negativity going on around here. I don't, I don't, it's too much going on. It's too much. What about Aquarius? I know. No, I'm telling you. I'm telling you what I have. I don't have Aquarius. Don't try to make nothing fit. This is not a Zodiac. This is not a Zodiac. I didn't get Aquarius. If I get it, I got you. But I don't have that. Anyways, um, yeah, somebody's gonna, it's like, yeah, it's too much. It's too much going on. Like, it's too much. Let me, let me light this bitch up again. Hold on. Just take it how it resonate. It could just be the energy. Take it how it resonate. Don't try to make nothing fit. Just watch and chill out. You know, just watch and vibe, watch and vibe, watch and vibe, watch and vibe. All right. I ain't gonna lie, I got a lot of people on up out of here. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Cause I got a lot of people left. I ain't fuck with it. Thank you. Okay, so now they back. <laughs> um, it's something about legal action here. Somebody's definitely could be a lawyer. Something here about you may need to take legal action, or something's gonna work in your favor as far as like legal opportunities. Somebody's definitely could come in and try to breadcrumb you. And put you in some type of debt here. Yeah, somebody wants to work with you. Somebody wants to work alongside you. Yeah. Yeah, somebody who's solely dependent here. Somebody solely dependent. Somebody who's solely dependent on your energy and on what you got going on. This is giving somebody who's solely dependent on your energy. Somebody's expected for you do, to do everything. Somebody's expected for you to have all the answers. Somebody's expected for you to do most of the work here. This could be somebody who sees you as competition. Yeah, this, like, okay, this is somebody who sees you as competition. This woman is, is definitely, she's in poverty. She don't have money here. This woman sees you as um, an opportunity and competition. She, she's very intimidated by how good how good you got yourself go, um, set up. She's de she definitely um, intimidated by how good life is for you. She's intimidated by how good you are doing as far as a man here. She definitely could be an energy vampire. She could definitely act like she want to be with you. She want to partner up with you, be with you, like be together with you and work alongside you just to bring you down. She want to bring down your vibration because you're doing too much because she's not doing enough. I heard she want to bring down your vibration because you're doing too much. She wants to call. She want to cause a tower because you're doing too much. 
She want to bring you back down to your level. Because you're doing too much. So she's going to try to have everything put on you. Yeah, she's going to try to have everything put on you. Everything. 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 Divine Femme, this could be for you as well. Take it how it resonate. Take it how it resonate. You got a man who's going to come in and try to be with you because you got so much going on. It's like yo, it's like you too bright here. Your light is too bright. Remember I told y'all 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 light is expanding. Y'all are going to be around a lot of people. Y'all are going to be attracting a lot of people here. A lot of material gain, a lot of spiritual gain, a lot of prosperity. People don't like that. People are trying to lower your vibration so that so that way they can be on your level because they feel like you're doing too much because they're not doing enough. They feel like they can't get to that certain level that they want to be at here. Yeah, because I'm getting you've been putting in overtime. You've been working your ass off. You've been putting in overtime. You've been working your ass off. And people don't like that. Collective. I'm also I'm wanting to let y'all know somebody's definitely yeah they they they're coming in to distract you. This person is gonna be nothing but a distraction towards you. Nothing but a distraction. Somebody wants you to stop working. Period. Somebody wants you to stop working. Period. Because they want to distract you. You're gonna have a whole lot of distractions in your energy. I ain't gonna lie. A whole lot of people trying to um lay up with you. Just so they can get near you, so they can bring down your vibration. There's a whole lot of people trying to sleep with the enemy. Somebody sees you as an enemy. They're trying to get in the bed with the enemy so they can get close to you to knock you down. You know what they say? Keep your enemies close, but they keep your friends close, but your enemies closer. Yeah. They're trying to knock you off your pivot. They're trying to stop your flow here. People want to get in where they fit in. They want to get in where they fit in. So be careful people trying to lay down next to you because people who lay down next to you can definitely, can definitely, can definitely be the ones that's trying to bring you down. Watch yourself. Watch yourself. You got a lot of competition here. People going to try to come in and get with you. They're trying to distract you. People trying to distract you. People seeing you at work and they're trying to distract you. Because you are empress. You're high power. You're powerful. Your light is going to bring in so many people. So be ready. Be ready. Be ready for people to come in and try to throw you off. Be ready. And that's the truth. Be ready. Be ready. Because it's only going to get worse before it get better. Because these hoes going to come in and keep on trying to play. But I know you powerful. You too powerful. You're going to be, you, you going to see right through it. So it's going to be like, what's the point? What's the point? You're powerful. You got this. You got this. You're going to continue to work hard. You still working. You still doing your thing here. Yes, and you're still going to come into your divine unity because people are trying to stop that too. They're trying to have you walk away from it. I know Empress. But y'all, that's all I got for y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Just stay true to yourself. Stay being you. Because child, the freaks is out. 
Y'all been saying it's Mercury. Like y'all been saying all the drama and stuff. Mercury retrograde is crazy. And it's just like it's just Friday. Like it's been like I'm just letting y'all know. Like these people gonna be coming out crazy at y'all. Like, or they gonna be portraying. Like you can really see through people. You are gonna see how crazy they is. Like for real. You are gonna see how crazy they is. I ain't gonna cap to you. I'm just letting you know. Like child under that moon, they get crazy. I ain't gonna lie, I'm starving. Y'all welcome. Just keep being y'all. Um. Now you fine. I actually, um, it, it, in anything, y'all help me, you know, because at first I, um, I was like, um, I wanted to say, shut the fuck up, stop talking while I'm doing it, and then, like, stop talking while I'm doing it, it's disrespectful, but then I learned, you only allow things to distract you when you're worried about what you're not supposed to be worried about, you get what I'm saying? I learned to, you know, worry about what I'm supposed to be worried about, multitask, you get what I'm saying? So I'm not worried about it, it's actually helping me build and to stay focused on what i'm worried about you get what i'm saying like i can do this click that so it's actually helped me so i'm not even upset at y'all for um talking in the comments because i know for a fact that somebody in here listened and somebody in here got some information got clarity got wisdom so it i'm not chipping i'm not tripping i ain't charging it to y'all hearts i'm not tripping if anything this is a lesson in a test i think this was, this was god trying to show me are you going to let people distract you? You see how y'all was talking? Y'all were distracted. Like, y'all was trying to distract me, but I kept going. That's why I went into the whole thing about how people are going to try to come in and distract you from your talent and what you're doing. Because they see you doing it, and they see you focused, and they see you doing good at it, and you're expelling. You're divine. You know, you're light. You're going to attract everybody. That's why I went on about that. Because I because I saw them in the cards. So, it was actually, you good. I'm tr I'm good. Y'all be helping me out. I'm not um, worried about it. Y'all can talk amongst y'all stuff all y'all want to. Because one thing about it, y'all going to be able to replay it back anyway. So I'm not checking. So you ain't do nothing wrong to me. I'm good. But I hope y'all have a good night. I hope y'all have a good night. Um, Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Um... I will see y'all tomorrow. Thank y'all. I really appreciate it. Thank y'all. I really appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Um, Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see y'all tomorrow. I keep saying the same thing, y'all. But anyways, y'all have a good night.